There are several competence models that we can use as a reference to build capacity for digital youth work. We need to have individual digital competences and professional youth work competences developed to be able to plan, design and deliver digital youth work. Digitalisation of society, organisational digital development and our competences have an impact on the success of digital youth work. We need to be aware of the societal changes enabled by digitalisation and effects on young people. We should be able to contribute to developing professional standards and guidelines for digital youth work in our organisations. Individual digital competences and professional youth work competences are essential for digital youth work. To support the digital learning of others, it is imperative that we also support and invest in our digital understanding and practice. Skill IT for Youth Competence Framework includes nine competences specifically relevant to youth workers who engage in digital youth work and who are interested in supporting young people to develop 21st century skills. They fall into three competence areas. Competence Area 1 looks at learning and innovation skills and includes the competences related to succeeding in the increasingly complex life and work environments in today's world where one needs to be able to collaborate and communicate well and to think both critically and creatively. Competence Area 2 covers information and media literacy and has the competences needed to be effective and responsible in a technology and media-driven environment. With access to an abundance of information and rapid changes in available technology tools, Competence Area 3 is focused on life and career skills and covers the competences needed to plan and manage oneself and one's work, as well as the social and emotional competences required to navigate today's fast-changing life and work environments. We can use the online Skill IT self-assessment tool to identify competences we lack or need to improve, or those that we have already acquired and use at a good level. The expert group on digitalisation and youth identified training needs in seven areas of competences required to deliver digital youth work. These are digitalisation of society, planning, designing and evaluating digital youth work, information and data literacy, online communication, digital creativity, safety online, reflection and evaluation. To be comprehensive, we can assess individual and collective competences and identify training needs in our organisations. DigComp, the European Digital Competence Framework for Citizens, is a useful tool to assess and develop individual digital competences in five areas – information and data literacy, communication and collaboration, digital content creation, safety, problem solving. Our individual digital competences are the foundation to develop professional competences for digital youth work. In addition, professional competences take into account the importance of designing and planning youth work activities, the organisational aspects and the broader aspects of digitalisation of society. So, how can you develop competences? Use competence models as a reference for self-assessment, plan your personal and professional development, Put your competence to practice and keep updating.